Let's make a bolt and nut with the spin duplicates tool. If you want to learn this step by step, go on over to my website. And the first thing we're going to do, make sure you turn on your bolt factory, create a bolt, and then also create a nut. Make sure that the nut's a little bit bigger so it'll actually fit and work. Then we're going to put our 3D cursor right here, add a shape, uh, maybe tone it down so it's more pyramid-esque, and then turn it on its side and scale it down to fit. That looks pretty good. Make sure it's sticking just a little bit in. Put your 3D cursor right in the middle of the head, and then spin duplicates those guys around 360 and put as many as you want. Then you can duplicate those, rotate them a little bit. That's looking pretty cool. Duplicate those, and then maybe duplicate another one and bring it on down maybe one more for good luck then we're going to take that and do the exact same thing on the nut here so just put your 3d cursor where you want it add a shape and i'm going to do a sphere but make sure it's not biting into your threads then you want to put your 3d cursor in the middle and spin duplicates but we don't want this many duplicates because it's a hexagon so let's just switch it over to six and that fits perfectly we're going to shift click these together and bully them and then do the same thing for the top shift click and bully them now if we move them it's all together like one object now we can simply export send it to our slicer flip it over so it's easier to print then we'll print that thing now we've got a screw that we can screw together with little ridges on it pretty cool right if you want to learn every single 3d print tool for 3d print design inside of blender 2.8 and 2.9 head on over to the website and we gonna learn some stuff